welcome back everybody so kill him. I can't where I come from we don't kill people for sport we help him well we don't help him as such and, and we kind of do kill him for sport but that's not what I'm doing right now I need him he's a good fighter come on mate The masters who once held your chains decided who lived and who died. Yeah. But as you can see, I'm not here to be your master. I chose you for a reason. True warriors. You're true warriors. Warriors I admire and respect. You deserve better than this. You deserve more than to die for someone else's entertainment. You love glory and gold and something fight greater. Fight with me, and it won't just be for sport. You'll fight for a higher purpose. To save innocents and murder the guilty. If you've got the balls to follow me, we will set sail at dawn. And to those too craven to join me, to hell with you! Well done. What a speech. Go, Asha. Oh. I knew them. What are those things? Well, you you knew them once, but you don't know. Oh, there's more than one. Uh oh. Um. Uh, square. Okay. Oh, oh, I hit it. I'm sure I hit it. Left. Uh, there, there, there. Oh, two. Go, 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 go. That's not really going to do much, I don't think. Um, I think you got to chop her head off. Or burn her. Uh, no. Anything could be killed. They won't die. Honestly, it won't die. Not going to die. And that's really not good. There, R2. Oh, chop his head off, R2. Can I just chop his head off? Come on! Uh oh. Uh, I don't think he's going to recover from that somehow. Oh! Oh! Get off! Uh, X, 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 X. Come on, X, X, X. Come on, 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 come on. Get off! Son of a bitch. Okay. <laughs> She's in trouble. Why won't they die? Because they're we walkers. Need fire. It's the only way. Oh, fire. Go, 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 go. go. Um no, just just that one. Yep. Uh okay, no, that one. The leg, the no, the head. The head? No. Right, the leg. No? Okay. Go, go, go. Get it, get it, get it. Pick it up. Oh, what do you stand there for? Just pick it up, you stupid Ooh. idiot! Pick it up! Oh, for fuck's sake. There we go. Um, there. Right. Yep. Oh. Uh, behind you. Uh, there. Right, two. Yep, yep. Good, 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 good. That's another one down. Right, can we get the others? Where's Finn? Uh, over there. Finn's kind of not in a very good way. Finn's in a very bad way. Finn! Um, we need to go. They're everywhere! Yeah, we need to get out. We need we to go right now. We need to stick together. Just fucking go! Don't argue! Just decide where you're going later. Just fucking go. Run. Run. No. Yes, now. Jeez, what have I been saying? I hope you're right about this, Garrett. Yeah, so do I. Just fucking run. We'll, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll argue whenever. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, who's got her? Uh, where is she going? Isn't this Tyrion's room? Your Grace. 
You're familiar with my brother's chambers, aren't you? Uh oh. Certainly you've been here before. No. You looked rather confused when you came in. As if you didn't know where you were. I don't. I don't know what you mean, Your Grace. I'm told you know these chambers as well as anyone. Really? Why? Why would you be You're told quite that? The curiosity, aren't you? You profess to be loyal to the crown, yet you're not very loyal to Lady Marjorie. Have I displeased you, Your Grace? I've heard things. I understand you've been quite busy. Tell me, do you consider yourself an honest, loyal handmaiden? Um, One can never tell with you northern girls. Assume only matters what you think. Exists I try to be. That's it, I try to be. I try to be, Your Grace. Hmm, I see. I've done my best to keep an open mind about people like you. Yet, Lucan tells me you invited yourself to Tommen's coronation party. How exactly did that happen? It can't have been easy. I, I meant, meant no harm, harm, Your Grace. I can't really I drop a Sarah, in it, can to I? Attend to. A personal matter. I'm told you used another girl to talk your way in. Mm. You're not above using people to get what you want. Good. Hmm? Why would you be so reckless as to risk your neck for what? It all seems rather careless. Family! My family is still very much at risk, Your Grace. It was crucial I attend. Your family. Sometimes that's a convenient lie we tell ourselves. When I suspect your issue with Lord Andros played a part in it. You've been such a busy little handmaiden. I assume Lady Marjorie knew nothing of this. Of course not. No, Your Grace. This wasn't the first time you've hidden the truth from her. You've no qualms about lying to her, have you? Well, I have. The truth. Oof. Only when the necessary. The secret is safe with me. Only when I must, Your Grace. I think we both know it's more often than that. No, it's not. I don't like lying to people. Perhaps I just I mistook don't have a lot of choice. For ignorance. But now I see there's more to you. You're a cunning girl. And perhaps you can help me. Huh? Your Grace. You're quite friendly with my brother Tyrion. I need you to speak with him before the trial begins. What? I want to know who he intends to call as a witness on his behalf. Oh, God. Consider it a favour to the Crown, for which we will all be grateful. Uh, I'll uh, try. I, I guess I could, Your Grace. It won't be easy. Tyrion is devious. Tyrion's going to know straight away. You have to hide your intentions, otherwise he'll tell you nothing. But he, well... You may prove to be a useful little bird. Why would I go and visit him? I hardly know him. do as you're told. In return, I'll take care of your problem with Lord Andros. Thank you, Your Grace. Really? I never liked the man anyway. And I doubt anyone will miss him. I'll say this much for her. If you do her a favour, she will return it. However, she's a devious little bitch. I'm not sure that's such a good idea. But I don't really think I've got a lot of choice in the matter. I somehow don't think Tyrion's going to tell me absolutely shit anyway, so... you hired this boat for nothing. No, I don't know. That was a rousing speech you gave, little brother. But who knows how much they heard. Ever since you left me to that dragon... I didn't leave you to the dragon. I had a lot of thought to staying here. Leaving you to your Westeros and your foresters. Oh, you have? Come on, Beskar. <sighs> don't be like that. I was angry. But you're my family, no matter what. Yeah, that's I'd a girl. I'd follow you anywhere, little brother. There we go. Just try not to get us killed. I'm trying. Think we'd let you live without us, Westerosi? They say your homeland is fat and Yay, we got the and fighters. Right we might make it. <laughs> we'll take what we want and kill anyone who stands in our way. No, not anyone. There's no spoils without victory. Yeah, we need <laughs> victory first. Don't worry about that. Victory is all we know. Cool. I'll show them their beds. Excellent. This is what we like. Doesn't look like there's many people there, to be fair, though. Oh, you came along. I'll be there in a moment. Glad you made it. 
What choice did I have? Not a lot. You denied me an honorable death. So I must find one in Westeros. Cool, get on the boat. I don't care how Fresco you do it. wasn't exaggerating. Hey, yeah. are you coming home? And you found your soldiers. Yep. Ironrath will be glad of your return. You came through for them. Yep. Finally. Just as I knew you would. So you stay. What about you, Uncle? Will you stay with the Queen? If I can, I'd like to help her reclaim the Iron Throne. Okay. Imagine what an ally she'd be to House Forrester if she succeeds. Living here has made a better man of you, nephew. Thank you, Uncle. Okay. I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't for you. You've guided me well. You are your father's son, Azure. How they guided him? They, they all abandoned him. He turned up proud. like... Ugh. I'll send a raven ahead to Ironrath to let Roderick know you sail for Westeros with the uh, cell swords. Yeah. Soldiers. My Just thoughts will soldiers. be with you in the fight to come. Thank you. Asher. Mm. Iron from ice. Oh, iron from ice. Iron from ice. Go on, go and be with your queen. We could we could have done with them dragons, but whatever, come on. Let's go. Let's go home. We're going home. Now what? Oh, Tyrion. Take this. It'll help loosen his tongue. He's not that fucking be stupid. Careful. He's a tricky little bastard. Yeah, and he's intelligent. If he figures out who sent you, he'll tell you nothing. Well, he's going to tell me nothing I'll anyway. Listening to every word you say. <sighs> Great. This isn't going to go well, is oh, it? I ask for brawn, they send me a handmaiden. Yeah. Well, you're here. You might as well come in. Thanks. Let me guess. Your family is in grave danger, and you've come seeking my help? Mm. Not that I'd be of much use to you. I bought you wine. I thought we were friends. Come as a friend. Tyrion. I thought so as well. Yet here you are. You brought wine. How thoughtful of you. And you didn't even have to hide it. He's he knows, he knows straight away. Hmm. Doesn't smell poisoned. 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 Cersei would love nothing more than to save herself the trouble of a trial. You don't expect me to drink alone, do you? No, take the drink. They never let anyone in to see me. Go on. Convince him. Just a little. Ah, true girl of the North. Hmm. Some things are worth dying for. Mm-hmm. Thanks. So, why are you here? Don't make it oh, obvious. It's rather unusual for a handmaiden to visit the Black Cells. Um, I've been worried about you, Lord Tyrion. Yeah. Oh, have you? You may be the only person in all of King's Landing who doesn't want to see my head on a spike. I don't actually. I like Tyrion. You and Podrick. Tyrion's I have cool. To admit, I've always admired your honesty. Thanks. But I suspect there's more to you than one might imagine. Mm, no. This is all a ruse, isn't it? See? Sorry. Told you he'd know about it. You're coming here. We both know you have an ulterior motive. No, I don't. Maybe I do. You've come to set me free. <laughs> it's the perfect plan. How did you know? <laughs> you found me out. How did you know? You can learn a great deal about someone if you're paying attention. So, tell me. Cersei sent you, didn't she? No. No, 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 no. Definitely not. I know I'm not wrong. No, you're not. Um... Are you toying with me? Yeah. I might ask you the same question. Now tell me the truth. Admit it. I don't know what you're talking about. No. She didn't know such thing. The guards have never let anyone in with wine. That was your first mistake. Mm -hmm. Not that I don't appreciate the gesture. I wish you'd had the courage to tell me the truth. Not that I'm above drinking her wine. I told you to be careful. He'll twist your words. 
stupid girl. You're acting a fool. Back off, Lucan. Watch your tongue, girl. We're not done talking, you imbecile. Give us a moment. Imp. Well, he knows now, doesn't he? What did my sister expect you would learn? Who will testify on your behalf? She's using you. Yeah, I know. And will continue to do so. Until you no longer prove useful. Mm -hmm. I know exactly what I'm doing. Oh, clearly. Uh, kind of. Which is why you're here, doing her bidding. I don't have a and lot of choice, do Lady I? what would Marjorie make of your new friendship with my sister? I doubt she'd be pleased. Assuming mm. she doesn't dismiss you immediately. Lady Marjorie doesn't out. know. And I intend to keep it that way. More to the point, she's nearly fucking got rid of me anyway. And without her protection, you're in a very precarious position. I already am. <clears throat> Bugger off. What should I tell Cersei? You're a clever girl. I'm sure you'll think of something. Although, oh, I would Tyrion. suggest you choose your words carefully. Cersei <sighs> would be far less amused if she catches you in a lie. Please, Lord Tyrion. I beg of you, help me. The only help I can offer is a bit of advice. Become a better liar. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get my head chopped off. You're wasting my time. Yeah. Out. Well, I think we'll carry now. this on with the next one. I wish you well, Lady Mira. Because I think she is going to end up in a lot of trouble. Be careful who you trust. We'll see. See you next time.